does not want anybody to suffer that kind of pain. He decided to send his only begotten son. Now, when Jesus was tortured for our sins, the pain he endured was unbearable. Because that was what was levied on everybody. He said the wages of sin is death. But the gift of God is eternal. 2 Corinthians 5.14 the love of Christ constrained us that for we thus judge for we thus judge that if one died for us then they that live should no longer live unto themselves so it's not enough to say I believe in Jesus there are many religious people in your territory there are many orthodox people in your territory they have no relationship with God what we are talking about here is not I go to church that's not what we are talking about we are talking about living for Christ he died for me so I will not live for myself naturally I would like to fornicate but because he died for me I will keep my body under subjection naturally I want to take a bride because he died for me even if it's not easy I will live a righteous life because he died for me naturally I would have wanted to be rich by shortcut but I will not steal to be rich I will not bow to an idol to be rich I did not just call Jesus Lord but I live for him today the reason is because he said no fornicators no liar no unrighteous man shall inherit the kingdom so it doesn't matter if you call him Lord there are people who called him Lord who went to church who were deacons in church in fact they cast out demons in his day when they showed up they say away from me away from me you workers of iniquity I know you called me Lord but your life did not demonstrate it because you came to church but while you are in church you are a thief you came to church but while you are in church you are a fornicator you came to church but while you are in church you are a liar and because you are a liar no liar shall inherit the kingdom no fornicator shall inherit the kingdom and so the only way to survive the only way to survive is to hang this body on the cross when your appetite draw you you say I am not my own I was bought with a price I don't live to do what I want our world is callous people wake up and they say it's my body people wake up and they say it's my money I beg to differ you own nothing in this kingdom they say you were bought with a price if it is true that you got Jesus Lord you have no right over nothing anymore your body belongs to him your time belongs to him your money belongs to him if you are still living for yourself regardless of the church you attend I came to tell you your destination your destination is the lake of fire wherever it is you are sitting Jesus said if you are not ashamed of me before men I will not be ashamed of you before my father I want you to make your way to the front here a new chapter is about to be written test and see that the Lord is good there are many Christians today we can't trust them they enter into politics they become wolves in sheep clothing the moment they see power the moment they see money they begin to worship another God there are so many men in business today they cry to God they run to prophets the Lord bless me the Lord has blessed them now the money is opening brothels the money is opening clubs the money is buying guns because what should have been a blessing have become a cost to their society I bring you a message tonight 
test and see that the Lord is good. I'm not just interested in somebody coming to religiously say Jesus be Lord. I'm interested in somebody who wants to carry his cross and follow him. There will be days of hunger. There will be days of tears. But you will stand your ground. You will stand your ground. A thousand may fornicate. You will not be among them. A thousand may lie. You will not be among them. A thousand may exaggerate. You will not be among them. Because you want to see the goodness of God. Can you begin to cry to the Lord tonight? Tell him, Lord, I submit to you. I submit to you. I submit to you. Tonight is the night. Nothing subdues me anymore. They are gods over Nsuka. They are gods over Obolo. They know that anybody that says he's a Christian, at best is a religious man. Because they know the Christians are the ones for the kids. The Christians are the ones lying. The Christians are the ones stealing. The Christians are the ones cheating. Come today, you take your stand. I'm not one of those ones. I'm a witness of the God of heaven. I'm a witness of the God of heaven. I submit to you tonight. Go ahead and cry. Son of David, have mercy. Yes. Our mama here. Have issues with fibroid. You have fibroid condition. Right now, she can't find it. You can't find the growth. She's looking for it. Come on. What are you what talking are you about? Give the Lord a Hold child. Up. For how many years? 22 years. Fibroid for yes. 22 years. Yes. And you can't find it anymore? Yes. Come on. Yes. Give the Lord a shot. Left ear she has not used for 12 years. You have not heard with your left ears for 12 years? Yes, sir. Completely deaf on the left ear? Yes, sir. Come on. I have not used it for 12 years. So you were not even hearing at all? At all. I'm not using it. For 12 I years? I was managing the right one. What happened now? Now I made God with it. What happened to mama? Jesus changed mama's garment. She My goodness. Said she has been a believer all her life since 1970 something. My she has God. never spoken in tongues. You have never spoken in tongues. But Jesus. Since 1970 something. What happened now? Now her tongue is loose. Like a katoa. Yes, what happened? At the instant of the war, yes, Papa here has had issues with his eyes. You had issues with your eyes. Terrible pain in the eyes. For Terrible pain. Months. For how long? For over six months. Over six months. But at the instant of the war, my God, the pain he can't find. Somebody it. give the Lord a shot. Yes, please. You need to hear this. Yes, please. Our Papa here has had issue of molestation and oppression for the past 20 years. He said there is no time that he closes his eyes without seeing snake pursuing him, without seeing himself being fed with poison. But since the crusade began, as he came here, since that day till now, he has not had that encounter. He gave a word concerning someone with swollen scrotum. Swollen scrotum. At the instant of the world. My God. My brother here felt something out. Something. Now out of he it. can't find the swelling. And the swelling is gone. Fat Come up here, brother. What happened? For the past three years. For the past three years. She has had terrible pain at her waist. My God. Loins at her jaw as if it's locked. She couldn't turn or bend. But right now, Jesus, the God of wonders, touched her. No, hear this. Talk to me. Our brother here doesn't believe in Jesus. My God. But he came here with terrible pain in his ear. And why Jesus wanted him to hear, Jesus touched his ear. Jesus entered the ear. Jesus entered the ear. Protect the pain. Protect and the pain. told him, I am Jesus. The God of Give the Lord a shout. <laughs> Growing out, yes, sir. She's the one, Mama. Stretch your hands towards me, cause that growth. Hey, go now, hey, come out, you devil. 
Come out. Come out. Come out. In the name of Jesus. Out of her now. Out of her. Out of her. Go in the name of Jesus. Now, now, now. Get out of her. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Our brother here. Yes. Had terrible issue with his ears. With his ears. He couldn't stay where there is noise or loud sound. But and the worst in the matter, he said cockroach enter his ear. Cockroach. And his left ear. So he has terrible issue with his left ear. But since the crusade began, he has been testing that ear, testing the both ear. To his surprise, he has been standing with the speaker and he cannot find a problem. So this little girl here yes. has had her stomach locked for the past three months. She couldn't eat because of excruciating pain in her throat. Nothing could pass. But right now, she can't find the pain. Oh my God. Did you hear this testimony? Yes, please. You made mention of someone that has a hole in the chest. This man said he has been having that problem and as soon as you made mention a of it. A hole in the heart. Yes, sir. And You've had that challenge for how long? Two years, a hole in the heart. He says suddenly, and you are free now. Please lift your hands to whatever. While the prayer was going on, prayer and impartation was going on, she came under power. And as she got up, she discovered that Osa has vanished. You had Osa pains for how long? For two years. But the pain is gone. Come up here quickly. Talk to me. Circumstantial turnaround. Talk to me. He said prior to this time, he has suffered stagnation in his business. Yes. But after last night's encounter, he made a tremendous sales today that he has not made in a long After time. the encounter last night, yes, yes, sir. You made a sales that you have not made. Well, come up here. Take that grace. You made a sale of pile. 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 For how many years? Over 10 years, pie. What happened now? He said, when you prayed, it, it, it has disappeared. Come up here, brother. Everywhere you are, from the left to the right, from the front to the back, my God, I God, I see the fire behind. Somebody has just gone down under the fire. Everyone expectant. Everyone hungry. Everyone hungry. Everyone in faith. Now take that fire. 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 Now take that fire.